become extinct in the 17th century is making big news at the Buffalo Science Museum. We sent Mike Randall on a one of a kind egg hunt. They found something in their collection they didn't even know they had. That's not a bad thing. I mean, there's 700,000 things in the collection. Kathy Leacock, director of collections at the Museum of Science, says the discovery is exciting. We found in our documentary evidence that it's been here since 1939. What they found was an egg from the now extinct elephant bird. That thing is huge. Now there's a hummingbird egg. This one is from an ostrich. The elephant bird egg is the biggest egg most of us have ever seen. Three pounds, five ounces. That's a lot of omelets. The reason this gargantuan egg could hide in the museum's collection all these years, it was mislabeled and thought to be a plaster cast until they found a big egg that actually was plaster. We're like, wait a minute, if this is the cast, what's that one over there? You don't hear much about elephant birds these days. They lived on Madagascar Island, were 12 feet tall with massive legs. It's hard to determine what they actually looked like because a lot of it is sort of folklore and stories that are passed on. Yeah. There are only a handful of elephant bird eggs in museum collections around the country. Kathy says it's priceless, but one of them just sold at Christie's for $100,000. Now that's a nest egg. This egg will go on display May 1st here at the museum. Meanwhile, it's making news around the world. I now know how Buffalo Museum of Science looks in all these different languages. <laughs> there are many items in the museum's collection locked away from public view. So it's easy to find something that you didn't know was in here, huh? Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Some of them wild, wonderful, weird, or just old. Their latest discovery may fit all of those categories, and that's no exaggeration. In Buffalo, Mike Randall, 7 Eyewitness News.